In Cognos, it is possible to schedule a report. That means that report would be created periodically and a user would get that report on his email. In order to create a schedule, first we have to find our report and then we will, we will click on action menu of that report and then on properties. Uh, this will open a new uh, window and here we will go to this third tab to schedule and then we will click on button create schedule. And this will open a dialog where all of the options for schedule are uh, placed. First, we have to define the frequency of our schedule. We can choose between uh, daily or monthly. I will choose monthly and I will choose to create my report every uh, fifth in month. Then we have to uh, define period of time. I will disable this option. A period of time is a period between uh, these two dates. So I will change this uh, second date to something in future. For example, to this date. And our report will be created only in this period of time. After this uh, time, there will be no more creation of our report. But if we want to create our report indefinitely, then we have to enable this option. So a uh, report will be uh, created each month without uh, end. Now, at what time of day our report uh, would be created, that is something that we can change here. We can change uh, hours or we can change minutes. We can go now to this second tab to options. Uh, here we can uh, change file format for our report. We can change, for example, to Excel. I will disable this HTML option. Then we can enable accessibility support for people with poor vision. Here we can uh, select this option save. That means that our report will be saved as output version. And the most important setting in this dialog is here, send report by email. Now, now I can click on this edit details uh, link, but first notice that we are here in this second tab. When I click on edit details, we will just go to second part of this uh, tab. We can go back with this uh, arrow to first part, or we can edit details, uh, click on a link edit details, and we will go to this second part. Now here we can enter our email recipients. We can enter subject for our email. We can enter email body, or we can choose how to uh, add our report. We can add our report as a link. That means uh, that user would have a link, and when he click on that link, he will go to Cognos, and there he will be able uh, to see and to download uh, uh, output version of our uh, report. So report could uh, wait for a user on Cognos, or we can uh, send uh, our report uh, to user as attachment, which is also possible. Uh, then we will go back. Here we can also uh, change language. Now language could be important if we uh, send our report in a CSV file format, because language can influence how CSV file format is created. We can change our language by canceling this language by clicking here on X, and then we can type some language, and then we can choose from this uh, menu. And we also have this third tab, prompts. Uh, prompts are a way to parameterize our report. So, for example, when a user starts a report, uh, starts a, an, ex an execution of a report, a user would have first to choose uh, something from some menu, for example, to choose some product. And then report would be created only for that product. But because this is scheduled for our report, there will be, there will be no user to uh, select that product. So we will have to select that product here by clicking on this button, uh, set values. But I will know not do that uh, now. And then we can click here on save and we will save our sketch. We will go back to this uh, dialog. Here we can see a summary of our uh, schedule. We can disable or enable our schedule. We can edit it or we can delete it. And if we click on close, we will go back to our report.